So here we are on our iOS 8 lock screen. And if I receive a notification, looks like I happen to get one just right then, I can uh, swipe across. And you see I have actions, so I can accept or decline this meeting right here. Now, of course, I'm gonna use the device. If I'm in here maybe playing some uh, music here on iTunes radio, um, I might get a notification. And if I do get a notification, I can just swipe down on it too. So here's one, just swipe down. And there I get access to my keyboard. I can type right there. Now this works great for third party apps as well. So for instance, uh, looks like I got tagged on Facebook. I can like it right here with an actionable notification. And sometimes you receive notifications that you just really don't wanna deal with right now, and you can just flick those away like that. That's really handy. Now, we've made getting at people easier than ever before, so if I just double tap my home button, see I have all the people I've most recently communicated with, I swipe to the side, and I have access to all my favorites. If I tap on one, I have controls here to give them a phone call, mess I message them, or even FaceTime right here with just a double tap on the home button. It's really handy. Now I want to show you some of the enhancements we made to mail. Let's go take a look at an iPad actually this time. So here we are on iPad. I'm going to launch mail. Now uh, I have a number of unread messages here, so let's work our way through them. Here's a message um, from OpenTable uh, with a, a, a dinner appointment, and you notice that the reservation is actually called out right here on the top Mail has actually given me an intelligent suggestion here to add it to my calendar. I can tap add, and just like this, it, lets, it prompts me to fill out and add an event to my calendar. That's really handy. Now, sometimes you get a message like this where you're gonna have to do some thinking about it, maybe get back to it later. Well, now with just a single swipe, I can mark it as unread. It's really cool. You can also flag really easily. So this is a message I wanna flag. Just flick it across and flag. Now here's a nice message. I don't know who this fellow is, but he says, great collaboration. You and Johnny have really come together really well. Let's take a look at that one. Oh dear God. <laughs> well this would be a good time to demonstrate our quick delete feature, where I can drag all the way across and delete at a glance. I'm certain that message won't haunt me on the internet for years to come. So let's talk about composing. I got a message here from uh, a friend who's visiting in town and is looking for a good restaurant, so I'll start replying to this message. And I'll say, uh, let's see, check out. And then, you know, actually I got a good recommendation from another friend here in my inbox, so I'd like to get to that now. Well, I can just swipe this draft down like this, go right into another place, another message in my inbox, tap out a selection. That looks like exactly what I want to send him, so I'll just copy that. And now with a tap at the bottom, I restore my draft, just like that. I can paste and send it on its way. I think we're all gonna love doing mail this way. That's a quick look at the enhancements to iOS 8.